hello guys welcome to this tutorial video where i'm going to be teaching us um something very important you know there are a lot of graphic designers out there whose challenge is about getting ideas for their designs some persons when a client gives them a job to do they don't know how to go about it how to begin it some of them when they start the design they realize that uh, ideas are not coming inspirations are not coming and, and stuff like that so this video is on on situations about um, lack of ideas or inspirations for your designs so before i go into it like i always say if you're new on my youtube channel and you haven't subscribed please subscribe to the channel like this video and also share the video thank you i believe you've done that now let me just go straight to the point i want this video to be as brief as possible first thing you should know about these um, design ideas or inspirations and the rest and, and should I call it design block or inspiration block like you sometimes not having ideas for your design the first thing you should know about it is that it is normal yes it's common it's normal don't let it discourage you lots of persons out there experience this same thing yes a lot of the persons you, you admire as, um, other, uh, as great graphic designers, they also experience. There were times that they never knew what to do, how to be about with it as, as they were growing. Even at the level they are on some of those experiences. Yes. So, don't feel bad about yourself or be discouraged. Understand that it is part of the journey. Yes. Now, I'm going to be sharing with us three things to do if you realize that you are having problems with uh, getting inspirations for your designs i'm going to be sharing with you what and what i suggest you do whenever you realize that all of a sudden or even before you are not having ideas for your designs right now i'll be sharing these things um quickly the first is this whenever you realize that you are not having ideas for your designs leave leave that design yes leave your phone and do something else that's just the truth whenever you realize that you are not having ideas for your design leave the design and do something else it's not all the time you kill yourself um, um, trying to keep to time I've, I've 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 seen some posts on some of these graphic design groups and you hear something like duration one hour duration uh, 30 minutes and you want to kill yourself to keep to that time because uh, the other person said one hour 30 minutes or 30 minutes that's not how to go about it you are not them and they are not you um, the time in which they did this uh, it might it might depend on the design but your your design is different your capacity is different everything about you is different so don't force yourself to be somebody else learn to uh, be yourself so Leave your design once in a while and do something else. Maybe you take a stroll, maybe you read a book, maybe just do another activity that is not graphic design and after a while come back to that design. So that's the first thing I would, and I would advise you do whenever you realize that inspirations are not coming. The second is that um, if you know you don't have the basic knowledge of graphic design, get to know it. For instance, there are a lot of persons who are into graphics just because they saw or they got to know the apps of graphic design so they just get into it because they, they got to know about pixel lab or canva or photoshop and when they got it they just entered other shapes and colors and images and they came up with something and then they concluded that they are graphic designers without having a basic or rudimental knowledge of graphic design most of those persons will have problems with getting inspirations you don't know the principles of graphic design like um, emphasis reputation um alignment and the rest of them that's not that's not good for anybody who is into graphics so i'm telling you the truth that not having a basic knowledge of graphic design can affect your inspiration when you design so get a coach get a course pay for classes i've taught a lot of persons who follow follows me on whatsapp to learn to pay for things of value if it is something that is valuable pay for it i know things are hard but if you do this payment and God helping you, you actually made the payment to somebody who is good in the field of graphic design, it would reward you. So that's it. 
Now, the last thing I'm going to be sharing with us is this. Learn to go and uh, get inspiration from the ideas of other persons. Now, let me say this. Almost everything you see, sorry, almost everything you imagine, you have seen at, mo- at one time or the other. It may not be exactly the same thing, but somehow they might be related. You get, you might, it, might, it might not be exactly the same thing, but somehow they might be related. So this is what I suggest. Whenever you have a um, problem or you're struggling with ideas, once in a while, just go on and see the designs of other persons and when you see it you get inspirations for instance if i realize that i'm not having ideas for my designs one of the things i do is that i go to pinterest yes pinterest is one of the websites or the apps or whatever you call it where one can get um get to see the, the designs of lots of graphic designers yes a lot of graphic designers out there on pinterest so if you realize that you are not having ideas go on pinterest and see those designs you just be surprised sometimes you don't even need to try replicating it you don't don't even do that replication and you know the way plagiarism is when you are writing a book that's how when you copy somebody's work without giving credit to the person even sometimes with giving credit to the person it doesn't make so much sense you just have to go ideas but don't copy now let me say this most times when you look at those designs for a while you just get ideas for your own design it might not be exactly it but ideas flow when you see a beautiful design so learn to to see sometimes you go to those facebook groups and um, see beautiful designs not only facebook groups like i said pinterest so not only pinterest as well you have um, uh, instagram there are graphic designers on instagram so whatever platform pinterest facebook instagram or whatever platform get the keep seeing those designs and all of a sudden you realize that ideas will begin to flow for your own designs all right thank you so much for for watching um if you have any questions you can drop it in the comment section and also um i have a graphic design group it's free and if you want to be a part of that group just drop indicate in the comment section and lastly i have um i have lots of graphic design resources for free so if you need them backgrounds and other things that you'll be needing for your design if you need them just um, comment in the comment section and i will send a link to you with which you can assess those resources so thank you so much for watching see you in our next video i believe you subscribed right subscribe like the video and also share thank you